Hey baby girls, ¿qué onda? ¿Cómo están? I hope everyone is doing super super well today. Welcome to another video. So today we're gonna be working, yes, as you guys saw. As you guys saw, we're gonna be working with duckies. So let's begin with the products. We're gonna be using butter pecan, which is available on my website. We're also using Nick Splat from the 90s collection, our number 14 Kalinsky brush. This one is currently sold out again. Thank you, baby girls. Thank you. But it's currently sold out again. Um, the other one is still available, so you guys will be able to get that one. The one, the pink one with the crystal handle. And we're also going to be using our ducky tips, duck tips, whatever. <laughs> our flare tips. Um, I do not have these available on the website. I got them off of Amazon. I'm pretty sure you guys can buy them there. Um, we're also going to be using our crystal clear acrylic and inside of our little pink dappin dish. Um, this one is so cute. If you guys are looking for a cute dappin dish to put your crystal clear acrylic in, this one is super cute. So I'm going to be swatching um, the colors for you guys so you guys can see how they look like together. They look super cute and those are the two colors we're going to be working with today. Um, you guys saw the base coat that I use. I don't know why this video is going super super fast on me i'm trying to like have it in real speed so you guys can see like everything how it is but for some reason it's going super fast anyway um i'm gonna go ahead and add a thin layer of crystal clear acrylic on my nail bed because i do want to shape them a little bit more and that's just gonna protect them you know what i mean so um since we do have a peel off base we don't want them to just pop off right away and yeah so i am gonna be showing you here how i'm gonna be shaping them a little bit more um i am using my bomb nails 8080 nail grit file oh my god you guys can you guys see our pink files they're so cute super cute you guys We have new stuff coming in and I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for everything to come in, you guys, so that I can tell you the release day. But for sure, August, okay? For sure. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and shape them a little more, as you guys saw. And I'm also going to be doing like the little, I don't know what you, I, I guess it's like a C-curve, half moon or whatever it's called. I don't know, you guys, this trend came back as well because back in the 2000s, you would do these type of designs and you had to have the little um c curve on your nails like you had to have the little c curve on the tip of the nail it was a must so yeah baby girls of course we're gonna be moving on to our acrylic application so from here we are gonna start by applying our acrylic we're gonna start by using butter pecan um i'm gonna start by applying it here on my thumb as you guys can see here honestly I don't know anyway you guys before i get more into the video this is a collaboration with a page x nails um we decided to do a collab on <laughs> these nails i don't know what we were thinking well it was me i asked her like girl let's do a collab let's do some duckies she's like yeah let's do it so we're here today we're here we're doing it I really don't know you guys um, I was excited to do them I really was but then I'm like these are freaking ugly you know what you guys everyone is entitled to their own opinion okay personally I think these are the most ugliest things ever ever you guys honestly whoever created these I don't know what they were thinking and maybe I don't know I don't know you guys I really don't know I don't know if they're in cloud nine. I don't know. But, girl, whoa, no. This is going to be the first and last time I'll be doing something like this. It's just because these are so trending right now. Everybody wants duckies. I've been seeing them all over Instagram, all over TikTok, all over YouTube, all over Pinterest. And I'm like, you know what? We have to do it. We just got to jump onto the little trend going on before it just goes away um and yeah if you are from you're a 90s baby and you were like a teenager or maybe in your 20s 
or maybe even 30 that one i don't know you guys but if you guys lived through the 2000s maybe 2000 uh eight nine i want to say somewhere around that i don't even quite remember when but i remember back when i was in high school it was literally everybody wanted these nails i never liked them not even back then i will never like them honestly there's one thing that i liked i liked it was so satisfying to do like the whole acrylic application it was satisfying you guys that's probably the only thing that i enjoyed about these nails was the application moment the acrylic application moment here was like everything i could probably maybe just go ahead and do another set just because of the application moment but girl no what am i talking about no th this is first and last time i promise you guys these are crazy these nails are the most craziest nails i've seen and there's worst ones there's nails that actually flare like really like out and i'm like girl how could you wear those like how could you even close your hand right you know what i mean it, it won't let you now another thing i wanted to mention is that i didn't really see i i mean i just went on to amazon i i clicked on a few of them and i was like you know what i'm just gonna buy these so i bought these and without noticing i noticed that there's longer ones like there's a longer duct tips you know what i mean and i regret not buying those i didn't even notice i regretted so much not even noticing um i think Paige did buy the the longer ones because her tips look longer than these these are super short but either way i don't know you guys like i don't know <laughs> these are by far the craziest nails i think i've done and again i'm never gonna do it again like i'm never ever 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 gonna do it again so yeah baby girls i'm gonna go ahead and keep on applying the acrylic again it was like so satisfying to apply the acrylic it was so weird i was like girl yeah i was on the groove here it was so satisfying watching those beads you know i don't know what it was but to me it was so 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 satisfying um and our 90s collection is about to sell out you guys i literally have like four or five acrylics of each of the colors like literally i'm almost sold out super happy about that thank you so much everybody who's been supporting everybody who's been supporting my channel my store even if you comment or you share the videos you share my reels on instagram on tiktok whatever it is even if you're just sharing that's helping me a lot thank you so much from the bottom of my heart it really means the world to me and if you're brand new here on this channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe i know that a lot of my viewers i've seen are not subscribed why aren't you like that's the question why aren't you subscribed to my channel honestly it's free go ahead and click that subscribe button for real and yeah baby girls yeah moving along <laughs> another thing that i wanted to mention is that i'm currently working on my fall collection it's literally august i remember last year by august i was already like i already had my like the whole fall collection you guys i was prepared for fall i don't know what i'm doing i'm barely ordering from my supplier the fall acrylics barely like just now as a matter of fact it was just i think last night when i ordered them and i'm like hey baby girl i need those acrylics asap like i need them she's like girl i got you don't worry they'll be on their way asap so i really hope that they get here really fast and really quick because i need those acrylics so last year's collection is gonna be volume one fall collection and the new colors coming in is gonna be volume two fall collection because i know that a lot of you didn't get to buy the ones from last year which were beautiful so of course we got a restock we got a restock on those and if those completely sell out on us and that's it like that's it you guys are gonna have to wait till next year you know how it is um but yeah baby girls stay tuned for that as for the new releases to um in august 
it'll be the new dappin dishes they're super cute you guys i cannot wait for the dappin dishes i don't know if i should like start bringing them out so you guys can start seeing them and do like a little reel so you guys can see what they look like and stuff um and then we're gonna have the files the buffers and a new sanding bands with the mandrill and these are the ones that are super super thin those are perfect literally they really fit around the cuticle area if you have clients even for yourself even if you're a content creator you should be doing like manicure like that so you guys can remove any um like like stubborn uh, cuticle you know what i mean just removing that so it's perfect i love it i'm in love with it i'm so so in love with it and of course we do have our files our buffers and we're gonna have i think five or no six brand new notes you guys so yeah these files are the 8080 nail grid files we've all been waiting for these you guys i think we've all been waiting since freaking april or may I, I don't even remember you guys and they're finally here they're finally 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 here and i'm just waiting for the freaking buffers you guys the buffers the, the supplier said they were gonna be here probably this week or next so hopefully by the end of the month we're gonna be having new releases and i'm so 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 excited but anyway enough of that enough of that you guys we're gonna go ahead and shape these babies out because girl let me tell you these need a lot of shaping like a lot like i they need a lot of shaping so i'm gonna go ahead and um kind of shape them remove uh, any like axis of acrylic that might have run down towards the side walls i really want to remove all of that these nails are super bulky even though i made them as thin as possible they look really freaking bulky i don't even know why um, but they're really bulky. By the way, I went ahead and removed the pinky. The very first one that I did with the acrylic application that you guys saw here. I went ahead and removed it. It was looking very short and very, very fat. <laughs> so I went ahead and removed it and I actually double tipped it. I went ahead and added a tip. Um, and then cut it really, really short and then glued on the the same tip or the duct tip on top of that one just so that i could make it longer so yeah you guys i've noticed that these tips they're not like really they're very uneven when it comes to like sizing um like the pinky is very short i think the index nail is really short as well um but i noticed that the ring finger the middle finger and the thumb were super long so i really don't know i don't know but i tried my best I seriously tried my best and now I'm gonna be here filing, debulking everything. I was trying to make them as thin as possible because again, these nails are super bulky, super... And since I tried to remove and debulk as much as I could, I actually got to that um, Aura, Aura, I'm sorry, Aura design, um, the orange part of the nail and I actually kind of filed off a little bit. <sighs> after you know i finished everything that's when i noticed it it was too late already but yeah i don't think i should have done that but anyway anyway you guys i guess you guys be the judges you guys tell me what you guys think how you guys feel about them would you guys rock them do you like do you like them has it grown in you i mean i don't know i don't think it, it's grown in me it, it really hasn't as much as i see them I do not like them I don't like them so of course we're gonna go ahead and buff after we are done buffing we're gonna go ahead and remove any dust particles because we are gonna be working with gel and I like to cleanse with a little bit of alcohol and some lint free wipes and this is what the nails look like yeah that's what the nails look like you guys tell me what you guys think do you guys like them do you guys not like them but yeah let's go into the like nail design portion so i'm gonna be doing a little frenchy here we will be working with oranges as you guys can see in this design i wanted something kind of like crim crimsicle i think that's what it's called creams creamsicle creamsicle <laughs> i can't say that but yeah i wanted something like creamsicle vibes so yeah i gathered kind of like the oranges that i wanted to use the gels that i wanted to use 
so this gel is from madam glam if i'm not mistaken yeah i think it is from madam glam um so i'm gonna go ahead and do a little frenchie here on the index nail it was super easy actually to do this frenchie i thought i was gonna have the hardest time ever because my sister usually does get shorter length nails and every single time she comes in for a new design she's asking for freaking frenchies so since they're super short they're really hard to do i don't know that's just my opinion and i don't know it's it's just hard on me so i was like oh my god it's gonna be so hard and actually it wasn't it was actually very very easy so yeah you guys i'm also gonna be doing like that um little trend going on right here with the blossom gel i went ahead and added the blossom gel and yeah we're gonna be doing this tiny little design of course after that we're gonna go ahead and add our rhinestones a little charm here and there and yeah that's literally about it so yeah i'm gonna leave you guys to this part and i'll be back true i forgot to mention you guys we're also going to be doing a little 3d flower here on the middle nail because we're going to be adding um like a rhinestone frenchie vibe so i wasn't able to add a whole bunch of rhinestones because again these nails are super short but i did try my best to kind of squeeze in a whole bunch of crystals and yeah that's all we did
of course we went ahead and top coated i made them super shiny i am using our shiny top coat from my website um you guys can go and purchase anything from my website right now um some things are out of stock but i promise they'll be back in stock soon maybe i don't know it depends on what it is the brushes i know for a fact they'll be back in stock but that's pretty much it you guys um this is the end result i really hope you guys liked it honestly i don't know how i feel about them i i can i cannot love them as much as i want to love them i don't love them i like to see them like if i'm going or scrolling through instagram or through tiktok and i stay to watch it because it's kind of satisfying to watch like the whole acrylic application like i mentioned before but i just don't love them you guys i don't like them i don't love them i no, like no i no. So yeah, baby girls, this is it. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for being here. Um, I will see you guys on the next one. Don't forget to check out Paige's design. I will have the link to her channel in the description box below. And go support my girl. Please go support her. She is awesome. So yeah, baby girls, I will be seeing you here on the next one. Stay safe. God bless and bye-bye.